Dear God, I often feel that I take all my worries and concerns to all places. Except you, I am aware you hear me kings of kings. Better the little that the righteous. Have then the wealth of many wicked, for the power of the wicked will be broken. But the Lord upholds the right ears. But better a little with the fear of Lord. Than great wealth with turmoil, better a small serving of vegetables with love. Than a fat and calf with hate red. Believe me, I will keep all my promise, my child, I will not leave you comfortless, I will come to you. You must not get discouraged, and you must not give up, you will see your hours, at just the right time. It is a partnership, because you cannot live up to God's standard without his help, he gives the grace, while you do the work through his empowerment. T from your end and total dependence on God to be able to stay on cause in this present age. How often do you read the word? How much do you know about God's will and ways? How do you define holiness below what? Dear Lord, there are times when I know I worry, excessively and fuss about even the tiniest of things, such as what I should wear, what to eat, and so on. The worst part is that I even worry about what will happen in the future. I understand how foolish it is to worry about something that does not even exist now. God's gift of salvation is for all men, but his kingdom is for those who worked out they asked unto holiness. Fear God, and observe is waste be confident that he who began a good work, in you will carry it on to completion, until the day of Christ Jesus say this powerful. Prayer right to the end, to claim his full blessing today, most gracious Father. I thank you for the salvation of my soul. And that of my family, thank you, Lord, for loving me even while I was lost. Thank you for redeeming me from eternal condemnation. Jesus sat down opposed the place where the offerings were put and washed the crowd, putting their money into the temple treasury many rich people threw in large amounts. For God so loved the word, that he gave his only Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish, but have eternal life. Jesus, I pray that I never worry about my future. You have not offered me the grace for bearing upon future concerns. I will avoid worrying about what is going to happen tomorrow from now. Onwards, my Lord. Speak my name over every worry, every stress, every uncertainty, and every need. In all your ways acknowledge me, and I will make straight your path. Know within your heart that I am the Lord of all, I am the Saviour of the world who is thinking about you. Tight guess if you believe. God bless you.